Okay, so it's been another week, and where am I this week? Well, this past week, the big thing I did was I went out to the career office center or whatever it was. I don't know what it's called, but they have jobs there. So that's where I went. They didn't really have any work like I was hoping to find, but they did have some work. So I'm set up for at least one interview this week, and I might be able to get another one. I'm not sure. But at this point, it looks like everything is going fairly well on that front. It's not exactly what I want, but it's at least a job. So I can stop stressing out just a little bit. I also... I took care of some design work I'd been working on. So that was something. I finally got it, you know, sat down and I did it. So that was something good, and I also finally finished a vlog that had been a little bit more challenging than some of the other ones. It was the one from August 7th with the Bonodori Festival. But I wanted that one to be something a little bit extra because it just was something extra, and I had a pretty good time. So this past weekend, I stayed here, and I played video games. I don't need to feel bad about it. Because if I had gone out somewhere, I wouldn't have accomplished anything either. So I stayed here and I played Torchlight 2. It's a game my younger brother had given to me on Steam. And I had been not playing it out of spite, but I finally decided that that was being a little bit unreasonable because I needed something new to play, but I didn't want to pay for anything. So I decided to play with the toys I've already got. So I've been having fun. It's similar to Diablo 2 or a number of other games where you just run around, kill monsters, collect loot, and go back to town. What makes this one stand out is a lot of very little quality of life kinds of things. Conveniences, things that are kind of sort of fun and interesting except you don't think about them being fun and interesting, but they give a little bit more purpose and point to the things that are going on in town. For example, there's an enchanter. Any item you find out in the world, you can take to the enchanter to get a random benefit put on it. And if you don't like the benefit, you can pay him to remove that benefit and then put a different one on it. Which sounds like a lot of busy work and just a way to waste your gold, but in previous games, there had been a problem that there was literally no reason to have gold except to pay for repairs. So they gave it a point. So, you know, little things like that where it makes things seem less pointless. I've also been sticking with my language studies. That's something that I've been on the ball with. I did have to back up a little bit recently, but I feel like I'm making progress again, even if it's a little bit slow. And I've also been watching a lot of anime, because I'm counting that as study time. I probably spend about an hour each day studying. So I've, I've been watching a lot of anime. I finished Bungo Stray Dogs. I also started watching a new series, ReZero, which is really good. It's like starting over a life again from zero in another world or something. ReZero is how I remember it. And... It's about a guy who goes to another world, and any time he dies, he comes back to life, like, a few days prior. So he gets to relive the same period of time over and over until he finally gets it right and doesn't die. And he hates dying because it's very painful. So I'm um, having a good time watching that. I absolutely devoured the series, but it's still being released, so I'm not done with it. Now I have to wait and be patient and watch once a week like a civilized person normally does, which is not how I like to watch my anime, but this one was good. Also, Olga's finally moving into town, and she'll be starting school soon, so I'm hoping to see her some this coming week. If I do get the job that I've applied for, then this might be the last week that I can go out to my anime group meetup and also the last week that I can paint things without making a special trip for it. So I'm going to try to have a good time doing that. One big thing is I'm a groomsman in a wedding coming up this weekend. So Amy and Chris are finally getting married. They're my 
landlord housemate people and I had to buy new pants. You see all of my pants are dressy pants but they're having a country wedding so I needed to wear jeans. Well I haven't bought jeans since I was in college so I had to go out and buy some new jeans. But now I have less dressy clothing that I could be wearing when I go hiking or whatever. So at least that's something. But overall life is going fairly well. I'm happy with the direction I'm moving in, but I need to take care of my student loan information so I don't fall behind on them. And I also need to apply for grad school because none of the jobs that I'm seeing is work I would want to make a career of. I'm going to do it. I'm going to be happy about it. But I don't want to do it for my whole life. So I'm going to really look into getting a going back to grad school at UNC Charlotte.